Well, here's the uh, repair on a Panasonic uh, massage chair. It's uh, not too complicated. So these belts are uh, hard to come by. So. Matter of fact, I can't find any on the internet, even even in far away China, which usually has everything you need. And this is this was made in Japan about 20 years ago. So, but one of the, one problem I had here was the belt was slipping, and this clutch here—it's an electric clutch. And I took it apart and cleaned it with some 1500 sandpaper on the shaft and 600 grit and 400 grit on the uh, on this housing and uh, for some reason it was a little bit uh, out of round and it was dragging plus it had a lot of uh, some black soot it looked like metal shavings. So I took that apart. That's a 10 millimeter nut there. And you need to hold a pair of vice grips or channel locks on the shaft here, which you can see there's some gouges there. But to hold the shaft, you need to hold that shaft so you can get the nut off. And then very carefully, you have to pull off that uh, kind of like a flywheel there. And there's nowhere to grip it, so you just have to rotate uh, with one channel lock on the hub and some some tension on it, and then hold the other side here. And then this one over here is the same thing. It's the front. The front pulley is a press fit. The secondary one is a, a clutch activated one. And uh, depends on which setting you're using. Uh, it works uh, works on the remote. What I did here was kind of in, in you know, we're not gonna use any words for it, but I used electrical tape, about four wraps on the pulley. And again, over here on this pulley. And it's got a double groove V-belt. These V-belts, you can't buy them. You can't find them. Same thing on this one, it was a little bit, a little slack on the on the belt. Now it's got it's more taunt and uh, very very good. And these rubber belts are made out of some magic uh, compound. I've never seen it before. But these belts are over 20 years and have no signs of cracking. So this rubber tape here, this black rubber tape, vinyl tape, works uh, like in a you know an adjustment. So we'll see if we can change the settings now and we'll go to lower back see if it responds there we go also the remote controls here the hand controls are are uh, also nothing available for spare parts so if you see one of these broke down somewhere Take it home because spare parts are really becoming a thing of, of value, especially to someone who can fix things. So we have the, this is a limit, and there's there goes our rotating thingy. So I use, use WD-40 and some regular silicone greases and somewhat things.